So today I'm gonna do a quick review on the J and Top thumb grips for the Nintendo Switch. Now these thumbsticks cost me around $7 on Amazon. They were shipped from the US. I saw these thumbsticks on eBay, but they're from China and I decided to order the ones on Amazon instead. So the first thing we're gonna do is cut the tape here. Let me just cut the tape. Take it off the flap right here. Okay, so. All right, that's pretty much everything that comes inside the package there. Okay, now we take it out the package here. The case, and this case is pretty durable actually. If you don't, you're not gonna use anything else, just stick it back and it'll stick back how it is, how it was. Now the one thing I was worried about is the thumbsticks here because on, on other thumbsticks from other companies, I read some of the reviews and it says that the thumbsticks remove easily. They can easily be taken off if you really try to um, add some pressure to the thumbsticks. Today we're gonna check if these thumbsticks have a good grip of the, of the Nintendo Switch thumb, thumbsticks here. Before I start, there's, there is nothing plastic in here. Everything is rubber, silicone, because I bought some thumbsticks from another company for my Sony PlayStation Vita. And on the bottom of the thumbsticks, they had this plastic cover inside of it. So whenever you um, try to fit it in, it fits in perfectly and it fits in very, very tight. And so far, this is not going to happen since it's not plastic and it's not molded into the Switch's thumbstick. I don't know how good it's going to stick on the Switch. So let's put it on the first one here. Let's see how easy it is to actually put on. Oh, how hard. Oh, it's pretty much it. You just place it on top and then you just twist it in. So, but so far, let's see here. Um, so I'm playing, I don't know, it's kind of sturdy. Yeah, it's, it's pretty sturdy actually, as you can see there. All right, let me put the other one on, P trying to shove it in here. Um, yeah, the best thing you could do is just twist it in. Yeah, that is the best thing you could do is just twist it in and it'll, and it'll stick right in. Yeah, it feels good. They feel comfortable. They have a small shallow shape to it. As you can see there, it has these four dots on top. Keep in mind, everything is made up of silicone and rubber. It's not plastic. Um, uh, let's, let's try to add a bit more pressure here. I'm trying to add pressure without adding too much pressure because if I had too much pressure, it, I could, I don't know, I don't wanna break my thumbsticks on my Nintendo Switch. I really don't, but even if I do add pressure, there's a stop at the end of the thumbstick. So it makes contact with the plastic here and it prevents it from taking off. As you see there, it stops it and this way it won't peel off so easily. Yeah, you could basically the 360 degree angle, it has that, it has that function there. So far, nothing is happening. It's not coming off, it's not slipping off. I mean, if you try to add pressure like this, Oh, yeah, you can see it's slightly peeling off at the bottom there. Like it's slightly peeling off and if I just do a bit more, yeah, it peels off. I mean, that's if you grab it by the edge. But if you're like playing normally or intensively, yeah, these, these will work. Because right now I'm kind of adding pressure. And now let's try out the second pair. They're just a bit smaller as you can see they're by twice the size yeah it feels very good it has a good grip very good grip uh, let's see here if it peels off if I start to add pressure on the edge yeah these don't easily take off as you, as you're seeing I'm trying to take it off by the edge here yeah these are not take these are not removing but they are much stronger than these right here now let's try to get the um, that does have some tape right here, some adhesive tape. Um, not that sticky. As you can see, look at my look at my skin. It's not sticking on. It's very good, but hopefully it stays on for the meanwhile. Um, oh, that's basically it. 
is it basically just sits on top of the buttons. It's still click, it is still clicky. They feel pretty nice, but I didn't buy this for the D-pad. I'm not even gonna use this, so. I'm gonna use it with the buttons here itself. But so far, so good. These stay on very, very well. These will not be coming off if you're playing an intensive game. The thinner ones will stay up better than the long ones, but the long ones will still stay even if you're playing an intense game as well. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And um, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.